All right, Knights of Apollo, what is up, guys? We are back with Age of Empires 4. We're continuing the Normans campaign. We're on uh, 1141, the Siege of Lincoln, or the first battle of Lincoln. Uh, it's going to be a lot of fun. The Empress Matilda made her move for the English throne, fueling the fire of the Civil War. And Baron Von Games coming in with a friend request. <laughs> well, let's go ahead and accept that. All right, so let's... um. Let's go ahead and get this started, and I'm I actually okay. So I'm gonna be real with you guys. I actually started the uh, I started this mission, but I had to replay it because I I I don't know. I I just like did I hear this correctly? So you'll I'll I'll show you what I'm talking about. Let's just restart the mission and watch this intro. After England defeated the French at the Battle of Brimule. Normandy was back in King Henry's hands. But one year later, his good fortune turned to tragedy. In 1120, his son and heir, William Adeline, died in a shipwreck. Karma, right? For the killing his own Henry brother. The first kingdom was in jeopardy. God, it's like monarchs are just so Henry desperately fragile. needed a new heir. With no legitimate sons left alive, he broke with tradition and chose his daughter, Matilda. Henry forced his barons to swear an oath to accept Matilda as queen. But when the king died, they broke their promise. Shocking. England would not be ruled by a woman. Not yet. Matilda's cousin, Stephen, saw his chance and claimed the throne. Oh, her cousin. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> when I first, for some reason, I thought it said is her son. I was like, wait, what? At Westminster Abbey, Stephen was crowned king, but Matilda wanted what was hers. She was also lining up powerful supporters who would fight Stephen for her right to rule. Their conflict engulfed England in civil war, fighting raged throughout the land. So cool. These videos are so cool. Everything focused on one of the kingdom's most strategic cities, Lincoln. Matilda's allies had commandeered the castle. But King Stephen was determined to take it back. He besieged the castle. Stalemate. As dawn broke on February the 2nd, Everything was about to change. Matilda's half-brother, Robert of Gloucester, raced to break the siege. As Robert's forces approached Lincoln, Stephen's army turned away from the castle to face them. Robert could win Matilda the crown, but only if his army could win the day. All right, epic. Battle of Lincoln. Yeah, so the first time I watched this, I, for some reason, I don't know if I just, like, mentally checked out for a second. Uh, but I thought it was Steven was Matilda's son. And I was like, what is going on here? <laughs> what, why is there... Wait, wait, I'm so confused. Okay, that makes sense. So it was her cousin. Uh, which, you know, I, that, I mean, if you have a law where you're not going to have male or female uh, leaders... Um, that makes sense, like the cousin of the of the king or whatever nephew would be his nephew. Uh, I think that makes sense. If he doesn't have a proper heir. Anyways, let's just get in here and play. Lincolnshire. Lincolnshire. Robert of Gloucester's forces approached Lincoln. Their task, to liberate the castle from King Stephen's siege. Okay, this While force looks way smaller than the video. Troops loyal to Matilda held the castle for the Empress. First, All right. Robert's forces would stage an ambush to prevent enemy reinforcements from joining with King Stephen's army. Okay. So, set up an ambush. Just go ahead and to move all units in the ambush site. Set all units to... Um, let's, let's get a little bit closer here to guard mode which is right here v is the hotkey 
All right. Robert's men concealed themselves in a sheltered grove and lay in wait for the enemy. You wait. Eliminate enemy reinforcements. Oh, uh, they don't even know what's coming. Steven, my dude. You're done for. Eliminate the first column. Oh, archers too. Oh. Poor, poor archers. Oh, sad day for them. Look at them all. Oh, they got some spears in there. The Quiet, dude. It's an ambush. What are you doing? Hold on, hold on. No! Ah! Spread out, spread out. Kill him, kill him, kill him. Kill them all. <laughs> I love that. You know, we're sitting like, quiet, guys, quiet. Here they come, here they come. The ambush. <laughs> the enemies, here they come. It's like, dude, shut up. We're setting up an ambush. What are you doing? But he knew more were on the way. All right, next ambush site. All right, we got to eliminate the second column. Are they going down the same road? Uh. What? What's going on? <laughs> What's happening? Okay, so we're at an ambush site. <laughs> and we're waiting for the second column to show up. Um. This is funny because, or, I don't know. What, guard mode? Okay, I think, oh, they're over here. Oh, is this the second column? Oh, it's moving. Okay, my bad. It's the star, isn't it? Dang it, we're, we already screwed this up. Hold on, wait up! Hold on. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> well, this is the worst ambush ever. <laughs> it's like that scene from uh, Monty Python <laughs> where the guards. Oh, objective failed! <laughs> Dang it! <laughs> That scene from uh, my Monty Python where the guards are like just standing there and you just see the knights like running towards them like what the heck's going on here? Like what's going on? Okay, okay, okay. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Keep walking, keep walking. Let's go set up the next ambush over here. We lost all of our cab in our surprise. Hurry up, hurry up. <laughs> You are by far the worst ambusher. <laughs> Alright, that's my I was wondering what that star was on the mini map. I was like, what is this? <laughs> Alright, so they should be. I wish. They should be coming up. Oh, what? How did they see us? Hey, you gotta get those archers. Gotta get the archers. Silence the archers. Come on, kill that pike already. Clean them up, boys. Yeah, we got them on the run now. There you go. Keep it up, keep it up, keep it up. Hey, can someone help this poor guy? He's by himself over here. Hey, come on, help him out. What are you running away for? There we go. Eliminate the reinforcements. Bada bing, bada boom. We failed one objective. And now Robert's men would face a stronger enemy in battle. Great, great. Continuing the push towards Lincoln, Robert sent in a large company of reinforcements to aid his vanguard. Okay. To further weaken the siege, Robert would need to cut off Stephen's supplies. He targeted the nearby market town. 
<laughs> common uh, medieval tradition destroying nearby villages all right group up guys let's go oh yeah just form a big box here we'll do line formation there we go that's better archers in the back here all right march men march oh this looks like a grand medieval army marching to glory that's for sure not under my command but archers um fire at the pikes all right just sent my cav into their deaths all right focus the enemy archers we must take the village there we go not all of you guys try to spread out of here a little bit get these archers here keep pushing keep pushing Oh, just executed that guy. Get him, boys. Get him. Oh, there's more. There's there's four more. Oh, no, no, no. That's just buildings. Okay. I was like, oh, my God. There's four more markets? My army's not going to make it. Oh, reinforcements arrive. A large group of knights arrived at Lincoln to bolster Robert's army. Hell yeah. They're like, these these ain't no simps, guys. They're like, we don't want no woman. <laughs> King Stephen's supplies began to Oh wait, no, these are four women. These are these wait, these are simps. Okay. <laughs> They're fighting for her. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Got that backwards. Were en route to join forces with him. But King Stephen had the roads to Lincoln heavily guarded. And the route was not without risk. Even for the hardy Welshman. All right. Rendezvous with the Welsh. Okay. Let's go. The Welsh are over here. Ah, they're in the classic green. These units, your allies, you don't control them directly, but they help you fight. Okay. Well, let's go group up with them. Marchmen. Rendezvous? <laughs> what does that mean? Uh-oh. Alright, um, knights? Don't charge in right away? Let Matilda's Welsh allies were ambushed by the king's soldiers. Robert's men would need to aid the Welsh if they wanted their help in breaking the siege. We must aid- we must- the Welsh! We love the Welsh, right? Come on. We're coming, Welsh. Go, go, go. Here, let's um get the knights going by themselves so they're a little bit faster, right? Aren't they faster when they're not marching with infantry? Everybody else, go after the infantry. Yeah, for the Welsh. Yes. These knights are epic. We're here, Welsh. We're here. You do not stand alone. Heck yeah. Get them, knights. Forces on the road to Lincoln. Matilda's allied troops made for the castle to lift the siege. All right. It's time for the castle. Or, okay. Game saving. I was like, oh, we're frozen. All right, so defeat besieging forces. This has been a cool mission, you know? Ambushing, destroying villages, rendezvousing with uh, allied forces. For Matilda. Whoa, who's this guy? He thinks he's a hero. <laughs> I'll take this whole army. All by my... Oh, yeah, dead. What was he thinking? You know, like, what? It's like, all right, I've got the perfect position right on this bridge. Oh, wait, I'm on the wrong side of the bridge. No. <laughs> Dang it. They're on the same side. Oh. All my years of reading about Thermopylae wasted. 
All right, we're coming. Don't you worry. Oh, we we're sneaking in the back door. Robert's forces spotted a large detachment of oh, no, we're not. guarding the castle gate. Hold on, hold on. If they hope to liberate Lincoln, they will Knights, need to no. break the blockade and rout the army. We do not want the knights to charge into that. Come on, destroy the blockade. Archers, go for their archers. Alright, there we go. We got a path. We got a path. Charge! You will not keep us away from our empress. Get rid of this. Alright. Take care of the rest of these archers. Infantry, go, go, go. All right, make sure you get behind the stakes, not in front, please. All right, charge. Are we going to do an epic castle defense? Oh, this is going to be this is going to be a cool mission, guys. Very cool mission. There we go, guys. Let us in. We're here. Leaving the gates to the castle unguarded. We're here to uh, protect Matilda. Yes, yes. Now it's under my control. A oh, man. <laughs> Robert's men finally united with Lincoln's garrison. They could now use the castle to strengthen their army. Yes, okay. To lift the siege, they needed to destroy the enemy camps surrounding the castle. Okay. Go so clear the western camp, clear the central camp, and clear the eastern camp. Oh, that's easy peasy. All right. I wonder... I wonder if I could just send my knights out this way and go a long way around. Maybe get behind them. I don't think so. I, I just don't think the knights are going to help you much with all the blockadage. So let's start with this camp, the eastern camp first. So let's um rally up some troops. Um, get some archers. And whoa. Look at all these guys. So we are going to, first off, do some upgradage. And let's get some more bows. All right, we got some workers sleeping on the job. All right, we need, um, yeah, how are we going to get wood? I guess we have to, like, sneak out here and collect some wood. Oh, no, there's wood over here. Okay. I guess they're safe over here, I suppose. All right, well, you guys get working on the wood. Um... Let's get some people on gold here. We need more than just three or four. Let's get more than that. Okay. Doing good, guys. Doing good. Um, you guys go here. There you go. All right, this upgrade's almost done. That's going to be good. It's going to make our spears a little stronger, though we don't really have any spears. Oh, man, we need a lot more gold. Come on. Can't we just make credit, you know, and pay ourselves back later? Uh, let's get a priest over there, too, so we can kind of heal the troops. You know? Um, okay, workers going to get gold. Got another archery range here. We got a siege workshop, which is nice. Food's good. We're good on food. It's just gold. Gold's the problem. I might even take some of the um, woodworkers here, put them on this. Cause that's that's our biggest dilemma here. Excuse me? Get them, boys. Alright, okay, you guys gather up over here. Alright, so we need 300 gold to get this leveled up. Oh, we do have... Hold on. We've got a market here. So what we can do is sell some food. Bada bing, bada boom. Bada bing, bada boom. That way we can level up these soldiers. We can recruit a couple of them. Meanwhile, we still have workers going to get the uh, and the gold. 
Uh, let's go ahead and build another lumber camp a little bit closer so we gather wood a little bit faster. Um, the priest is over here, or at least he's on his way. He's going to start healing. Hey, don't you... Hey, hey, knock it off. All right, we, we got to... We got to hurry up here. I would like to get this, but we need 300 gold again. So let's actually sell some meat. Oops, I bought meat. Dang it. I'm the worst. All right. And let's upgrade the archers. Because they're going to be a huge help. All right. Oh, my guy's charged out. That was silly of him. Just kind of looking around. Make sure we're not missing anything. Oh, we're really gathering up the gold now. All right, men. I think it's time we fight. Uh, I'll cancel this. So our archers get leveled up. It's kind of cool. They're using the walls to travel around. What, what, a siege tower? Alright, I've had enough of this. I've had enough of this. We'll leave the knights here. It's time to push. Let's go! Charge! Ah! Attack the archers! Oh, that's a lot of... Sp that's a lot of... More swordsmen, please. More archers. Keep it up, guys. Oh my god, they have so many troops. Some of you guys kill the archers, please. Alright, since we uh, cleared some of the barricade. You know what? This siege tower is pissing me off, man. What is this guy doing? You think he can just roll around here without any kind of... Yeah, resistance there. Alright, get in there. Alright. Try to avoid the stakes, please. There we go. Trample them! Kill them all! Not today, Steven. Alright, so that's one camp. But we're gonna need to strengthen our army. Destroying one of King Stephen's siege camps. Hell yeah. Alright, get back over here. Yeah, now we're gonna be mass producing some troops. Now we have a food problem. It's always something. All right, so what we can do, thank God for this market. We can um, sell some wood, because we have plenty of wood. And we're gonna buy some food. And boom, it's just simple economics here, guys. Simple economics. Economics 101, sell wood, get gold, buy archers. All right, simple economics. Okay, so. Uh, oh, we can level this stuff up. Okay. Uh, the army is coming together nicely. Um, it's doing pretty good. Oh, come on. Leave us alone. All right. So let's go ahead and uh, do the next attack. Um, we still have our knights and stuff. So, Dang. That's all the swords we have. What happened to our priest? Did he die? He was like, I'm going to join the battle for Jesus. Jesus, priest, right? Calm down. Got to keep you alive to heal the troops. Uh, here's a... Are these... Can I trade? Hold on. Let's let's get a caravan and see if we... Can we trade with ourselves? Is there another market around here by any chance? A little bit further away. Oh, let's get... Oh, let's get a mangonel. Okay, what can we sell? Uh, we could sell a little bit of wood and a little bit of meat here. All right, let's get the mangonel. That's going to help us a ton. And once that mangonel comes out, we're going to we're gonna go destroy him. Nice. 
Nice, nice. Still getting more troops. We're looking good. Gather up, boys. Gather up. There we go. Fantastic. Oh, we can get veteran longbows from the church? Alright, you. Um, trade. Here. All right, we're trading between markets. It's probably not going to generate that much wealth, but that's okay. Um, can we upgrade this? Yes, we can. Let's do that. Kind of increase our food. Okay, Mangano, Mangano, where are you? Ah, there you are. All right, let's get you hooked up, buddy. Can you reach from here? No, but we'll get you close enough, and then we'll just defend you. We got to hurry up, though. They're getting feisty. Come on, Mangano. What are you doing? Ah, uh, you know what? Dead. You're done. Stephen's army had broken through the sturdy walls of Lincoln Castle. Uh oh. Those loyal to Matilda had to ensure that the keep did not fall. All right, let's get some defensive troops here. All right, we got to push, boys. Yes, yes! Knights, get the Manganel! Alright, get these archers. You knights, go on the flank. Totally did this on purpose. Whoa, knights, no! Fall back, fall back. Right, I want to go for these units. They scare me more than any anybody else. Get the infantry! Yes! Charge the infantry. Archers! Knights! Charge! You knights! Alright, get them, boys. Get them! Get them, boys. All right. And then there's one more camp. We should have a strong enough army to deal with this. Hey, what are you, what are you doing, coward? Get up here. Oh, you noticed? You finally noticed me? King Stephen's army dwindled as Matilda's forces struck down another siege camp. Yes, we did. All right, set up here, archers. Go, 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 go. Get it, get it, boys. Oh, uh, bad place to set up a, a mangonel. Oh, and you're shooting at my knights? Here, knights, 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 knights. Go for the siege tower. Go, go, go. Fire at them. Give them hell, boys. Give them the cold steel. Knights. Get in there. Spears. Get in there. Spider Man. Or Matilda. Or Matilda. Alright, let's keep making some troops here. Actually, no, go over here. Oh, yeah, we got this in the bag. In the bag, guys. In the bag. Clean up these archers. We're golden. Let's. Steven's gonna think twice about messing with Matilda. And, uh. Her half uh, brother lover. <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised. Who knows? 
half brother lover. <laughs> Lincoln did not fall this day. What? Shielded by his men. To end the siege, Matilda's forces needed to capture Stephen and rout his army. Um. Oh, is he trying to run? No, he's not. Everybody, we need everyone here. Come on. Alright, uh... We need to produce, produce more troops here. Archers. Let's get some archers over here. Oh my goodness. No, he's so low. Oh. Alright. Regroup, regroup. We gather. Oh, my knights are dead. Are you still attacking? Oh, he's healing now. Oh, the disgrace. All right, um, let's get a manganel again. Let's get more archers here. Uh, let's get that upgrade, because why not? Are you sure you want to charge in like this? Come on, keep, keep going here, boys. Not done yet. One at a time, one at a time. Oh, that's a lot of troops. Keep on recruiting. I guess we could have built more barracks, but I'm lazy. You really can't be lazy in these types of games, huh? Oh, you're dumb. Here, get the gold. Get him. Get him. Destroy it. Quick. Come on, quick. Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Alright, more, more, more. More. More! Get this. All right, King Stephen, your army has been destroyed. You could not withstand the mighty um, Matilda troops. All right, focus him. Actually, take care of his bodyguard first, and then it's only him. Come on, fire! I need everything, everyone. Go, charge! Oh, he's so done for. Steven, you are done. And dead. Yes! Victory! Matilda's men closed in and finally captured King Steven. Woo! You're welcome, Matilda. You're welcome. That was a fun mission. Matilda's forces had won the battle at Lincoln. But the fight for the crown was not over yet. Look at Steven. Is that him captured? Is that him right there? No, that, that might be the queen. I don't I don't know. Whatever. Victory. Another mission done. That was fun. Okay. Um, so Lincoln is complete. Uh, I think there's another Siege of Lincoln that's going to happen. Um, some cool videos here uh, that you can watch, which I will definitely do. Yeah, let's watch one, right? I mean, it's it's only been 34 minutes. Let's watch 
A counterweight trebuchet. Trebuchet. This is awesome. Was the king of all siege engines. A catapult capable of smashing down castle walls from great distances. Oof. At Warwick Castle in England, they've built a replica, one of the largest in the world. Originating in 7th century China, by the 13th century, trebuchets had evolved into devastatingly powerful weapons. Such a simple design, but so effective. It has several key features. A pivoted arm with a weight at one end and a sling to hold the projectile at the other. To prime, the six-ton weight is raised using tread wheels. So this is one of the wheels, one of two that's attached to an axle, which would lift the counterweight, weighing six tons. It's based on muscle power alone. What's essential about That's launching cool. a projectile as far as possible is making sure that this end of the arm is moving as fast as possible. So once that weight drops, it really sends this point of the arm moving at its highest velocity. This was done by positioning the pivot close to the counterweight and by launching the projectile from a sling. When released, the sling whips round, vastly increasing the launch speed. That's what I want to be in the military, right? Back then, the wheel guy, you know? The guy who spins the wheel. In order to weaken the castle walls or even breach them, you had to make sure that the projectiles hit the same spot every single time. For each projectile to follow the same trajectory, they all had to be the same weight and shape. To achieve this, Masons used a gauge. Now, I'm going to load this projectile into the sling. Oh, this one must weigh about 25 kilograms, but some projectiles can get up to 150 kilograms. That's the weight of two men. This is cool. These little videos? Like, Trebuchets what the hell? were also used to throw burning tar, beehives, even dead bodies. That's Anything to cause maximum distress to the enemy. Did you hear that? Whoosh. Look at the crowd. It was the counterweight trebuchet's lethal combination of power and accuracy that made it the ultimate medieval siege weapon. Very cool. Okay, that was awesome. Um, that was really awesome. I, I want to go back and watch all these videos and stuff because what if we go to view all? Oh, no. All right, guys. Well, that's going to wrap it up for today's video. Thank you so much for joining me. Um, we are getting closer and closer to beating this. Um, but I'm just kind of taking my time. I think with the other campaigns, I might just live stream them or something and just have a good time with chat and everything. But I appreciate the support, guys. Thank you so, so much for hanging out. And I will see you next time on the battlefield.